have no fear, little flock. The Lord is your shepherd, the shepherd you need so that you have no want. He is your shepherd who has walked through the valley of death so that you need not fear its shadow, nor any other evil. For your risen shepherd is with you to the very end of this age and in the age to come. Have no fear, little flock, for Christ knows you, has called you by name in the still living waters of holy baptism and made you his very own. He gives you his white robe that is eternal life. You shall never perish. No one can or will snatch you out of the scarred hands of your shepherd, whose hands were nailed to the cross for you. Have no fear, little flock, for Christ prepares a table for you with the best of meats and the finest of wines, his body and blood. Not only does Christ feed you, he does so in the presence of your enemies of sin, death, and the power of the devil. They're defeated and cannot interrupt the meal or harm you in any way. Have no fear, little flock. Christ's goodness, his mercy, his salvation, they constantly follow you, pursue you all the days of your life, chase you down when you wander away, and comfort you when you are in the flock. Have no fear, little flock, for you dwell in the house of the Lord forever, gathered before the throne of God and the Lamb who was slain to serve him day and night. No more will you hunger, no more will you thirst. No more will tears flow from your eyes. All things will be restored, made new, perfected in eternity. For in this life there will be heartache and pain and suffering and hunger and thirst, but not in the life that is to come in the Good Shepherd. You will come out of this great tribulation because God is faithful. He will not lose one single sheep that he has purchased with the blood of the Lamb. The Lord is your shepherd, the only one you need. This shepherd was forsaken by God, pierced for your transgressions, crushed for your iniquities, and by his wounds you are saved. He has restored your soul, forgiven all of your sins, all your wandering gifts away, all your stubborn rebellion. In him, you have no wants of body or soul. He has destroyed the power of death so that you can walk in its shadow with no fear. He feeds and nourishes you with his word and sacraments in great abundance so that you never hunger nor thirst for that which does not satisfy. He's told you your future. You're among the great multitude that no one can count, a multitude from every nation, from all tribes and people and languages, standing before the throne of God and the Lamb who was slain, clothed in that white garment that has been washed in the blood of the Lamb. Have no fear, little flock. The Lord is your good shepherd now and eternally. Alleluia. Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Alleluia. Thanks for watching us talk at you. If you want to see us talk at you some more, subscribe to see notifications when we talk at you the next time. Donate to support Higher Things at higherthings.org slash giving. Help us to help you. And if you like this video, check out our website at higherthings.org and check out more content from Higher Things.